Today we'll be looking at an advanced testing of the Williams Alligator Indicator. But before we do, if you have not watched the first video on the channel and all the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. There is also a link down below to sign up for trading view you can save a little bit of money if you use the link below to sign up for your account you can also find a link below to join us on discord lastly if you would like a list of all the indicators we have tested along with their win rates but you aren't interested in watching all the videos on the channel you can sign up for our nine dollar patreon and you will receive the complete list of indicators. We also would like to introduce our Patreon exclusive Discord channel. As a $9 Patreon, you will be invited to join an exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators and links for the MT platform, give you winning strategies, post trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. All right, as I said today, we will be looking at an advanced test of the Williams Alligator Indicator. Before we do though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 53 different strategies with 15 of them being profitable. We've also tested a total of 744 indicators with 296 of them being winners. The best ones so far were able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. So go back and watch those videos and see what you can get out of those winning indicators. We also have retested at this point in the advanced testing six indicators. Three of them were able to maintain the winning status with the best one uh, able to maintain a 64% win rate. Now keep in mind that we test most of these strategies and indicators on the Forex market, but they can be applied to just about any market universally. Okay, so today's indicator is the uh, Williams alligator indicator and you can see it here on screen and now this is the uh, kind of standard uh, one here so this is um, kind of one of the default ones that uh, is part of the trading view uh, indicators under the technicals there and that brings up this one right here i did go in and bump up the line weight of these uh, but basically what we have is three moving averages and what we're looking for uh, is these moving averages to stack on top of each other uh, in kind of a specific formation. And so what we're looking for is when the purple crosses above or is above the blue uh, moving average and the green is above the purple and above the blue. And so basically what you have is uh, green on top of the blue and purple, purple in the middle and blue on bottom. Those are long trade signals there. Uh, um, then on the reverse side, basically what you have is uh, green on the bottom or underneath both the purple and the blue, like right here. We have green on the bottom, purple in the middle and blue on the top. And that is a short signal. Now, this particular one is um, kind of a leading indicator in that you can see that it's projecting the moving averages, these uh, lines out ahead of the price action. And so that is a little bit of an interesting uh, aspect to this particular indicator. Uh, this one also uh, was the first indicator that um, had less than less than 10 trades within the one year's time. 
and uh, because it had less than 10 trades we did drop it down to a lower time frame and so basically what we're doing is um, any indicator under 10 uh, so for example this one on the original test did nine trades nine signals and so i dropped it down to a 12 hour time frame and so the idea is uh, that most people don't trade um, like the 15 hour time frame or uh let's see what other what other ones do they have there yeah i don't even think they have anything above 12. you can go in and add custom time frames to this if you wanted to uh, but again nobody's really trading the 15 16 17 hour time frame uh, generally uh, from a 12 hour time frame it jumps to a daily and so uh, i figured the first step down since this was uh, nine trades uh, in the one year's time we would do a 12 um, hour time frame if it goes down lower than that then we'll just <clears throat> step it down kind of accordingly um, as it goes lower we'll go lower on the time frame so all right so uh, taking a look at the indicator here uh, again basically what we have is um, the cross here let me just back this up a little bit right here let's go back even farther right about right here so we'll just take a look at the indicator here real quick as i step it forward ever so slowly you can see that right here is when we get the official cross the uh, green is above the blue and the uh, purple line there and the purple line is above the blue line there and so that is um, all three of the indicators kind of lined up the way they should be there looks like we might actually have been back one more about there maybe let's try it forward one all right yeah so right there would be uh, when we get that official cross um, all together there and what we would do is mark that candle right there and then play it forward and you can see that this one uh, comes down a little bit but then pushes up nicely getting us to our take profit also another thing that i should mention is that because we did change the time frame we did cut the take profit and uh, stop loss um, in half and so uh, changing it uh, kind of according to the time frame that it's on scaling it down with the time frame so all right that's what we were looking for in this testing that's how we tested it in the original one what i'm going to do now is go ahead and do a, a fast forward version of the 50 trade uh, test that we did on it the advanced testing and we'll pick it up on the other side to look at what this was able to achieve all together All right, so before we take a look at what this was able to achieve, I'd like to give a quick shout out to our Discord server. This is our Discord server uh, here. This is our Patreon only channel on the Discord server that we have set up for all of our patrons. Uh, we post some really great advanced information here on the uh, Patreon only channel uh, for our patrons to take advantage of. This is Sasquatch. He's an amazing Forex prop trader doing regular market analysis on the Forex market, posting lots and lots of uh, wonderful opportunities and knowledge for patrons to take advantage of. Our admin Jay is also posting regular futures analysis and trades um, on the futures market. Myself, I am day trading the S&P 500. 
on basic options, posting those trades live as I'm taking them in real time for all the patrons to uh, 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 analyze and, and uh, follow along with and so on. And another thing that uh, is available is that if you are a patron of the channel, feel free to reach out to either myself or to our admin, Jay, and we'll give you a little bit of time uh, as a one-on-one -on -one session to answer any questions or help you advance anything you might be working on. So a lot of great benefits to becoming a patron of the channel and doesn't cost hardly anything at all. Highly recommend it. All right, back to our uh, indicator here, advanced testing what we had was the 50 trade test out of the 50 trades we were able to get 31 winners we had 19 losers that puts us at a 62 percent win rate i think that's a little bit better than what it was able to achieve um, in the original testing if i'm not mistaken um, but uh, yeah all in all it held up to the 50 trade test and so this one will move on um, and be put on the uh, retest winning list and we will move on to the next video from here.